Welcome back to another 10 days on the which of these characters will die this time because let's be honest, one of them is. We start out with the big McDowell. We are going to search for kid meals, toys instead. Trash? Uh, we get the... Um, sure. Okay. Uh, ABL, we are going to explore more. I'll do a factory rescue. I did check before starting this episode, and I only need three toilets in order to get Toilet Genie. So that's good. Wait, I need to know, can it use the <laughs> can? Oh, that's great. So, um, yep, this video will be going up on Christmas Eve, so that'll be fun. And, well, I mean, I guess for people that don't celebrate that sort of thing, December 24th. Strange to think, uh, from the point of view of this video getting uploaded on the 24th and just a week it'll be the end of the year. Not a lot of videos left. And I say that every time, but, uh, I mean, let's be honest, there really isn't a lot of time left. After this episode, we just have 50 days. Which... It's kind of crazy to think about. Because so much can happen in 50 days. But... So much can also not happen. I personally don't think the game is going to give me another spooky graveyard. And if it does, I don't know if I'll shake hands with death again. If it does come up, but I don't think it will. Depending on pace, that's I might I might trash Wolf. I might not. I'm not entirely sure right now. Because I mean, don't get me wrong, Wolf's an okay character, but there's not a lot of health, so just one ignite can leave it prone to just dying. And 
I will be honest, I'd rather use Toilet Genie Vitality on Swole Swan since I have much better faith in Swole Swan staying alive than... Yeah. So, I mean, yeah, probably at the end of this, just Swole Swan Vitality as per usual. If the game would actually give me lootable toilets, that is. Like, for example. Yep. Oh, please don't break that toilet. Alright, I just want to get out of here. Uh, here. Yep. And we're out. food anymore. I don't know what Carrie is. I'll run the risk. the risk. Um, go to sleep. Don't make the characters tired. The car's about to break down. We gotta fix that. Uh, we'll... The lamb on the brakes. Uh, we'll heal it off. So, I mean, that's fine. Attempt to fix. Vehicle chassis still looking fine, thankfully. Crowded. Well. I mean, that's okay, I guess. Oh, beans. Slowly carve our way into the building. And, well, I mean, we don't actually need to be in the building for this part. And, yeah, let's be honest. Not really gonna be helpful. If anything, it would take longer. What else do we have? The coffee shop, surprisingly, for once, isn't really going to be useful because both of our mechanically adept characters already have maximum dexterity. So... I actually don't get any benefit from this. Which is a bit of a shame, but oh well.
I mean, to be honest, I really don't even need to be looting here, but I just want toilet loot, honestly. I can probably get both vitality increases by the end of the run if I do this. But I think after I get maximum vitality on Swole Swan, I'm just going to completely dodge locations unless if it's gas. One more. Why is the trash can so good? It has such a high durability for it being a trash can. Right, just into the house. Bad idea, bad idea. There's our toilet chimney. Immortality. That's another point. 50 toilets to go. Do I even bother going into the coffee shop? I mean, for toilets, I guess. Which there are none! Heck yeah! I mean, I might as well. Just for the sake of, of, of what, posterity? Yeah, no dexterity to be had, just morale. We're out. Chassis has seen better days. Beth Road, sing along. Carry will plan out tomorrow. Okay. High wits. Oh, Wizbot being the, uh, like, the high attitude character? What? Uh... Wolf speaks. Hey! I actually guessed right! Perks of having a high attitude character, I guess. Maybe I'll... Swarmed Arcade, I guess. Vidya games. Got them Pokemons and the Yu Gi Oh's. I just listed two that could also be card games. I'm great at this.
Uh, we got a machine to siphon gas from. That's nice. What in the world is happening right now? This honestly just feels a bit chaotic. Alright, what is our disappointing machine of, uh capsule thing gonna be. Alright, get ready for this. I'm about to take damage. Or not. That's good. <laughs> That's a lot of toilets. The toilet luck has smiled upon us today. Um, we will leave them alone. Night Siphon. Obviously, Swole Swan. <gasps> That's good. I'll take that. Um. Sure. Hack it. Gas station siege, I'll take it. Wait for the dig up, there we go. Into here. This is good. We need the bigger room. Oh, beans, that's really not great. Hopefully all the zombies will body block each other. At least whenever the zombies fall into the room, they can't really enter because they're blocking the door. gas. That is an insult. Deathward sing along. We will plan out tomorrow again. I'll drive more and keep driving. Trader trap we will offer to heal injury. And our own trader camp. Uh, shooting training. Shotgun, why do I never get this? No wait, shooting training is the chair one.
Yoink. Oh, boo hoo. Uh, military supplies. Okay, shotgun peddler is the one with the box. Shooting training is the one with the chair. Big difference. Here's your Tino me. And charm. Nice. Let's go. Also, wait, that just means that Carrie has great attitude as well. So if Wolf actually has low wits, that means we have all of the personality stat combos. Um, grocery store. I'll do grocery store. So, um, for the good old holiday shopping, I have a fun time trying to find gifts for people because I just don't know what people want. So it usually just ends up with me getting comedically large things for people. So for example, for one family member, I got them a six pound can of green beans. And if you don't know how large that is, it's probably bigger than your head. Probably. Maybe a little bit smaller, maybe a little bit larger, maybe the same size. It's a big can, that's the point. And, uh... I just kind of saw it in the grocery store and I was like, this will make a good gift. And, uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's a can of green beans, what else do you really expect? Joy, here comes the night time. Wow! Completely useless house. Hadn't seen one of those in a while. Uh, 
Right, just gotta clear out the horde. It'll take a bit of time, but... Okay, let's go! Dark and creepy storm, you're going to want someone with, uh... Yeah, we'll send Small Swan in. It's a composure check, but paranoid characters fail it automatically, I believe. Maybe I'll... I'm not doing Danger Rangers. That is a death sentence. Uh, no, I'm going to ignore these. Uh, no. Toilet of past future. The group discovers something incredible while exploring a house. An actual working toilet. Everyone has been doing their business in the woods. The toilet has a futuristic control panel full of buttons. Will Swan feels compelled to press one and chooses the button labeled with a picture of... Wings flapping. <laughs> Alright, this makes stuff easier for me. Mini golf? Uh... He used parkour build, he's probably gonna fail. Oh! Okay. That works. Audio repair. I mean, Wizbot, come on. Abia. <laughs> no? I'll do Mystery Factory. What will the mystery factory be? If it's pistol bullets, I will be very, very displeased. Not sure why you wrapped around there. It's rifle ammo. That's good. I'll take that. Gives me more lenience on using my minigun. Okay.
Oh, jeez. I don't like big rooms <laughs> on this mode, especially. Ah. Uh... Okay, we were just very quickly getting surrounded by zombos and fire on all sides. Not great. We're managing, though. We're managing. Then that means that the safe should be over here. Along with the bathrooms, actually. I love having this level of strength and fitness just because of how fast I recharge even when tired. It's like a normal character uh, just recharging their attack. Mostly. Right, I'm assuming this is the end of the line. Uh, bathroom with no significance. Heck yeah, we. Yeah, no, nothing. Give me your snacks. Alright, what good loot will we get today? Uh, 60 rifle ammo. I mean, that's really it.
Moose in the morning, we will just shoot the moose. ABL. Um, nothing I want, so we're just going to go into the siege then. Alright, what's the game going to give us this time? I'll do a, a fitness tape. Fitness is always good to have. No, I'm good. I'm really good. I don't, I, I kind of already have enough dogs on my team. <laughs> Death car to right here. I'll actually dismantle the car for parts. That's really good to have. Engine's fixed right up and chassis back to normal. Uh, buff your breaking character. Oh! Well, here's the Tinomi. I'll do the complete guide to lifting. Increase strength on everyone. Peel Plarkin's, uh, yeah. Just wanted to give everyone Explorer again. You never know. Uh, I'm not going to go for the friend of dog one because I'll essentially only get dog recruits at that point. Do you know me? There you go. As if I didn't show it already, I forget. And... What is our siege going to be? Please be merciful. Okay, that's not great. I'll try to survive. Just gotta get to the back of the store. Just gotta get to the back of the store and we'll be fine. Ish. I mean, we'll still struggle quite a lot, but... Uh... Just go to where the giant horde is not. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. See, look, we're we're doing great, ish. Yeah, let's just go. So it appears that uh, my prediction at the beginning of this episode was completely wrong. No one actually died! Up oh, that- Okay! Sure! I'll- I'll take that! And I'll just go to sleep. And that is another 10 days on the death road to Canada! Next time, 50 more to go, and we'll knock out another 10. Wow. Are things finally looking up? Probably not, but I am hopeful. So, until next time, goodbye!